yung sa akin. Bakit si Amleto Campos si Rizal lang daw ginagawa? I showed it to you. Rizal left us with 25 volumes of writing. I had a whole career. Pag, binag, pag tinignan niyo yung column ko sa inquiry, pag Rizal yung topic, ibig sabihin wala akong malisip may sula. Kasi ang gagawin ko, ipikit ako, kukuha ako ng kahit anong volume ng bubuksan ko, ilalaki, itatayo ko lang sa din sa mesa, bubukas ng gano'n. Kahit saan bubukas yun, pag tingin ko yun na yung polo. Because Rizal simply covers everything. No? Uh, it's amazing what this man has covered in a short life of 35 years. No? But uh, what did Bonifacio leave us? Seven letters, which might even be fake. Rizal has photographs from age 14 hanggang sa barilin siya. Hanggang buo na siya, may letrato pa. Si Bonifacio, iisa lang ang letrato. And what is Bonifacio wearing in the only picture that we have of him? He's not wearing the red pants and the white shirt. He's wearing a coat and a tie. The hero of the masses, naka-Amerikana. Ano ang sagot ng mga kaibigan ko sa dilima? O yan, hero ng masa, ba't naka-Amerikana? Ah, hindi. Ano yan? Pumunta siya doon, naka-sando. Itinarkila niya yan doon sa photo studio. Ba't siya nag-arkila? Eh, kasi ano, wedding picture. Sabi ko, kung wedding picture, nasa si Mrs. Bakit siya na? No, so I mean, this whole thing, also, when we talk about Rizal and Revolution, Rizal and Bonifacio, the answer is not historical. The way to deal with it is to actually show them that the question is ideological. Hindi makikinig sa'yo yung pro Bonifacio kasi ang utak nun nakagawa na. But the point there is, we look at it historically. And we, we, we show it in the way that I show it. Constantino is lying. Constantino hid the most important parts of the story. And yet it is Constantino that is the inspiration for you to uh, But that's it. No, if you can prove it, wrong is okay lang. But that's the point. Hindi natin dapat, sino ang pambansang bayani? Lahat sila pambansang bayani. Aguinaldo, Mabini, the Luna Brothers, Bonifacio, uh, Sakai. Lahat naman yung pambansang bayani. If you want to change Rizal tomorrow, we can. Because there is no law that makes Rizal our national hero. He is there because nakasanayan na natin. The SWS and Pulse Asia survey already shows us the pattern. SWS survey, sino ang inyong pambansang bayani? 75% po si Rizal, number one. Bonifacio is number two at 35%. Ang layo ng agwa. Pulse Asia survey, who is your national hero? Po si Rizal, 85%. Number two, Manny Pacquiao, 2.8%. Number three, Bonifacio, 2.2%. What does that tell us? No, uh, Rizal is there because I think we see in him, our, we see ourselves in him. And I think Rizal gives us an idea of our capacity for greatness. There's something there. Kaya hindi na, ang, ang dami ng weight, nung araw ko gusto tanggalin si Rizal, gusto gawin si Bonifacio, hindi nagsaksid. Gusto gawin Marcos, hindi nagsaksid. Gusto gawin Minoy, hindi nagsaksid. Why? Is that American training? This is what I told Renato Constantino. I told him, if you tell me na American-sponsored hero si Rizal, parang yun ang sinabing napakatanga natin si Loy. Pag sinabi ng Amerikano, sige, si Donald Duck ang bayani ninyo, tatanggapin ba natin yun? Hindi. So, there is, they built on something that was already there. And that thing that is already there, I, I cannot explain. But Rizal, I think, uh, will remain hero for as long as he remains relevant for, for our times. Thank you. Thank you. Sir, last. Last. Then there's just one last question. Uh, there was one about whether Rizal retracted from Nation Ring. One, the issue is not important because everyone was a Nation. Parang Rotary Club yan no 19th century. No? Uh, did he retract from Nation Ring? The document exists. I have seen it, I have examined it, I have a photocopy that was made in my presence. And I know Rizal's writing. I have handled all the original manuscripts in the vault. I'm telling you, the document is his. Uh, you can forge a signature, but you cannot forge 17 lines of text. No, uh, my feeling is, and of course, Father Schumacher and everyone else says I'm wrong, 
But my feeling is, there was a time in the Pitan when Rizal wanted to marry Josephine Bracken, and he wrote out a draft retraction, which he did not sign. And he said, parang, oh, tingnan niyo muna yan. Kung kakasan niyo, eh, kasan niyo yung kami, pipirmahan ko yan. Kasi parang cheque, di ba? Pag walang pirma, walang halaga. Oh, and then di sila kinasal. I think it is that document that they added a signature to. But the document exists. But if you read it, this is really not saying anything. You have to be a Jesuit trained Ateneo boy like me to know what it is to practice mental reservation. To say something but in the back of your head, you're not really saying it. To write something and not really mean it. Uh, the document exists and uh, my, the only way to solve it actually is to subject the paper to scientific testing. If it is proven to be old and using the same inks that Rizal used, then the next question is motive. Why did Rizal write it? But since he's dead, I know how long ago, 20 years time ago, we didn't have Again, that is also a question that's also ideological. It's either against, for or against retraction. Kapag may kangusap kang retraction o anti-retraction, hindi nakikinig sa iyo kasi gawa na yung isip. But is it important? It's not. It does not erase what he did. He did not do it to save his life. When they, before they shot him, they got his pulse. And the pulse was normal. Pwede ka magkunwari na hindi ka takot, pero pag kinuna ng pulso mo, your body does not lie. So when he walked there to the pitan to be shot, it was part of a plan that he had planned even 10 years ago. That's what I keep telling people. Even what he wore, what he said, the way in which he would fall, he practiced that a long time before it actually happened. He knew what his place in history was, and he had to play the part. So that is the, that's the thing. So anyway, thank you again.